Hey guys, what's going on? So today I am going to be doing a quick overview of the Christmas celebration information. I was going to do separate videos, but it would be like a one minute clip for each one because there's not a lot of information here. So let's go ahead and talk about it. First off, the Christmas celebration pack is up for sale in Mobile House Trove. So if you guys are wondering about it, it's essentially a, a, a pack that you could buy for $15. Um, on in Pilas Trove, and it's really not that great in my opinion. I don't think you should waste your time trying to go and grab it. I'll actually bring it up on my phone in a second once I get my side sync up and running. Um, but essentially, you get one, uh, get, well, you get five guaranteed SSR tickets. You get a whole bunch of candy canes. And don't get me wrong, the candy canes are pretty damn cool, but they're not really worth it in my opinion. Uh, let's see over here. All right, let me bring it up. All right, so you go into, into the game, and this is the Pilas Trove over here, and you click on details. And you get one Master Roshi Santa, which is increases the super attack of anyone. You only get one of them. You get five uh, summon tickets, which is a GSSR, and you get three of each candy cane. Everything else is kind of whack. Uh, it's just some Awakening Medals. <laughs> um, honestly, I could see this being worth it if they gave you, like, five Santa Roshis and five summon tickets, or ten summon tickets, and, uh, and like, two Master Roshis or something like that. Honestly, guys, it's, it's overrated. I don't think you should pull on it or buy it. Do not get it. That's all that there is to it. Um, in terms of the redstone that we got, um, I am not going to do that in this video because there's way too much to take into consideration. That's going to be its own like 15 minute video going over everything that we know and everything that's going to happen. Uh, so all I'm going to say is if you guys are looking to go for the redstone um, that came into the gift box, look at all the units that you have or you don't have. Look at all the units that they actually, the teams that they would be on. Like for instance, Texel is going to be on, I believe, a revival team and a technique team, an extreme technique team. Do you plan on running that team? what teams do you currently have we go based off of that but i will be doing a more in-depth video i will say that full power freeze and super saiyan 3 angel goku are probably going to be your two number one choices just because they're dokenings but cell will end up having a really good uh you know if he when he gets his extreme z awakening if he gets immense damage which he should and he gets um, like a good uh, buff increase on his passive skill he might be really really good really hard hitter um, also, if you guys don't have an AoE, Broly might also be a good consideration for you. The only one who I don't know about is going to be that Intelligence Gohan. And honestly, unless they give him a percentage-based boost, I don't think he's going to be that great. Unless they give him, like, attack plus 100,000 up or something. <laughs> anyway, um, I will still go over that in a separate video, so don't worry. Um, but just look at your box and see who you currently have. Or if you really don't know, wait for that video and I'll go over it with you. At least go over the basics to help you make a decision. Um, let's go back over to Chrome. We have the new Dokkan Festival that is on. Now, if you guys joined me for last night's live stream, I did all these with you. So you get two sets of, or three sets of, or three rounds of Step Up Summon. So steps one, two, and three. By the time you get your third, you have five tickets over here. For every five tickets, you get a GSSR on the banner. So it's not a banner unit. It's any, GSS, it's any uh, SSR that's in banner. So what you do is you do step one for five stones. You get a whole bunch of candy canes, which is really cool. You get one ticket. Step two, 15 Dragon Stones. You get three characters plus a Master Roshi, which is a one super attack up, and you get one Christmas pa or one Christmas summon ticket. Step three is 30 tickets or 30 Dragon Stones, and you get seven characters plus three Christmas summon tickets. So that's five. So you do this three times, and you get 15 summon tickets. From there, you go into the actual. But there's a banner, a, a separate banner for it. you. Scroll down, and you'll see two separate ones: one for single summons, one for multi summons. You can do whichever one you want. I did multi summons. You could do single summons. It doesn't matter. There's no increased rates or anything like that. You go down. You click on whatever one you want. If you're doing singles, though, make sure you do all, all five of them so that way you get your GSSR. It doesn't carry over to the multi summon banner. So go over there, do that, do your summon, and after five of them or one multi summon, you will get a guaranteed SSR. The GSSR is the last one in the pull. So if you get any uh, SSRs before that last one, you will get a second SSR. <laughs> Uh, it's really cool. It's kind of worth it. You also, by the way, um, there's also the uh, mission rewards in order for you to get more tickets by doing the Godly Dimension or whatever the heck it is events. So you can actually go into the Beerus event, the normal one, go on sta the normal stage for 10 stamina, and you can grind that one out to ink so that way you can actually get all 10 done. So that's only 100 stamina for you. And just go ahead grind that out 10 times. Uh, stage 1, level 1, on the Beerus event, very easy event to beat, and you can get all 10 of them, and that way you can get, what, I think that it comes out to two more multi-summons that you can get, so two more GSSRs, and those are free GSSRs. So, you can go ahead and do that. I was told that last night, and it actually worked out really well. 
Um, last one is we're just going to talk about the banner. The banner is actually pretty damn hyped. I kind of like it. So if you guys didn't join me, I, I did summons on the live stream last night. Uh, it was probably about halfway through the live stream. Uh, you can go check it out if you want to. Uh, unfortunately, I, you know, I'm a little bit of spoilers here. I did not get Ultra Instant Goku or Super Gogeta. <laughs> like, these are the two that I really wanted. I'm not saying that I got all the other units. I'm just saying that I did not get these two, and I was very, very upset. So you will be seeing a video later on today. Um, I'm going to do one more set of multi-summons on the actual banner. Banner is pretty legit, so I'm not upset about it. Personally, my thing about this is I'm not really a big fan of Ultra Instinct Goku. Even if he gets a Doken Awakening and his passive becomes better, I still don't care too much about him. Personally, I want Super Gogeta and I want one more Super uh, well, Vegito Blue. Because those are the two that I really want. Because one, I want to get him 100%. Even though I don't need it, you don't need a 100% unit. I have 75% of him done. Um, or whatever the actual percentage is. I have well, I have three dupe passes. I need one more. So I want one more of him just to do it. Uh, and then Gogeta, I don't have him, so I would like to get him. <laughs> uh, outside of that, uh, you we also have some good units on this banner. As you see over here, we have Rose, we have Super Saiyan Blue, Kaioken, Goku. Uh, we have the 120 lead Kid Buu, so that's awesome. We have Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Vegeta, the Intelligence Vegeta. Uh, we have Fusion Zamasu, or Merge Zamasu. Uh, and we have Beerus. So all these are banner units, but the let me just restate this one more time. The GSSR ticket does not guarantee you one of these. Can you pull them? Yes. Are you going to get them? There's a chance that you won't. I was on the live stream last night, and I saw a lot of people. One, one, of, one of the guys who was on the live stream with me pulled four <laughs> Ultra Instinct Gokus in the course of his multi-summons. So who knows? Maybe you guys will get lucky. Uh, I haven't, so I'm going to go do some more just to see what I can get. I mean, I'm not saying I didn't get lucky. I got some really nice pulls. I'm actually happy about the pulls that I got. But uh, legit, I'll do some gameplay videos with those units. If you haven't seen it, go check it out. If you don't want to watch it and you want to see the gameplay, well, I'll be doing some gameplay with that team uh, at some point in the future, probably tomorrow or the day after that, or maybe on a live stream tonight. But uh, anyway, guys, this banner is actually pretty good. If you're thinking about pulling on a banner, this one, you might want to pull on this one. Uh, if you want to wait you can i think the banner actually ends uh, at least the special banner ends on christmas uh, i didn't actually do the math on that so someone let me know in the comments below let the community know i'll do a follow-up video on that one with the banner because i'll probably do a full review of ultra instant goku uh, on top of the actual banner and when it ends at least when the specials end tomorrow but uh, anyway guys thank you for joining me here today i hope that was helpful i hope that was informative i want to try and keep this a short video for you uh, make sure to subscribe if you are new here and i'll catch you all later peace